China. They are some crispy fingers, like chicken fingers. Fabulous cakes. Now, Roscoe, you were a little reluctant to buy these and you're still a little reluctant about <laughs> eating them. Do you think these are gonna be tasty or, or is this gonna just be, uh? Well, I don't know. So far, everything I've had has been tasty, so I'll probably be surprised again, hopefully. Hopefully it's not bland. They're meat-free, so no meat in these babies. But they smell good already. So we're gonna put these in first. Okay, what are we doing here now, Roscoe? Okay, we're gonna take these out. They've been in for... Few minutes. These are crab cakes that have that have no fish. They smell good actually right now. How long do those stand for now, Roscoe? Seven minutes, and then they'll all be ready. So back to uh... the inauguration of Uncle Joe. Now, Ross, have we talked about dipping sauces at all? I mean, how are we gonna dip? What are we gonna dip into these? Um, well, I don't know. <laughs> well, let's go over to the fridge and see what there is for the Roscoe. We don't want to look in the fridge. Yeah, we do. Let's yeah. go, Roscoe. Come on. Well. Now, no, that mayonnaise no, no. is uh, definitely not vegan, oh, Roscoe. Oh, there's eggs in here. Roscoe. Well, we could probably mix something with a little dipping sauce here of some sort. Got some poison sauce. I don't even, I really don't know what's in these sauces. Soya beans. Poison's okay. You've got some vegan parm. Look at this, yes. Roscoe. Go. Yeah, we had that on the uh, and yokis. And it was good. Yeah, you had those on the gnocchi. A little bit of mustard. And a little some bit mustard of mustard. Alert. Yeah, mustard's mustard fine. Should be good. Yeah, mustard's fine, yeah. Roscoe. What are those things? See. All right, so you're gonna mix all those in a bowl. Yeah. Mm. This is called the Roscoe special. <laughs> Great. It is sack time. So Roscoe, you're not apparently, according to some very angry trolls on the Hot for Food uh, YouTube page, you're not you're not technically vegan. No. If you're trying vegan, you're only trying plant based. What do you think plant about that? Based. Well, I'm trying. Don't fight it. Try it. Don't just try it. All right, here we are. I'll be amazed if this tastes like crap. Hmm. Tastes great. The texture's the same for sure. It's kind of flaky. Does it taste like crab? It doesn't really taste like crab, but with all the seasoning and everything on there, it's, it's, it's very tasty. If you were with somebody who was having crab cakes, you could easily have these instead and join them. Well, this is the chicken. That's a lot more dense. Do we like it, Roscoe? Mm -hmm. I do like it. Well, now, does it resemble chicken at all? Does it taste like a chicken? I mean, I don't know. Doesn't everything taste like chicken? <laughs> but does this taste like chicken? Um, I don't know if it tastes like chicken. It tastes good. Is this something you would consider having again, Roscoe? Absolutely. Why not? Do you feel good now that you're not like killing an animal for just for your, you know, dining pleasure? Yeah, absolutely. And I think that <clears throat> realizing that we always thought that seafood wasn't part of it, but seafood is a part of it. You don't think about them because you don't see them, I guess, under the ocean, but... They're living creatures too. Well, this is a pretty good substitute, I must say. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up, especially with the Roscoe sauce, it's great. Now, can we, we can get this sauce maybe on the Hot For Food blog, Lauren Toyota? <laughs> <laughs>